Welcome to Door County Drone. Today we are going to tell you a little history on this behemoth vessel. The Edwin H. Gott is a large diesel-powered lake freighter owned and operated by Great Lakes Fleet, a subsidiary of Canadian National Railway. This vessel was built in 1979 at Bay Shipbuilding, Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin, and included self-unloading technology. The ship is 1,004 feet 306 meters long and 105 feet 32 meters at the beam. It has a carrying capacity of 2,105,527 cubic feet, 59,621.9 cubic meters, has a 280-foot, 85-meter, unloading boom and is capable of unloading 11,200 metric tons an hour. This is a maximum load of about 74,100 tons. The ship has five cargo holds, but 20 hatches which are 28 by 11 feet, 8.5 by 3.4 meters. The hatches are significantly smaller than other large lake freighters. The ship was originally built in 1979 for U.S. Steel and was named for their former chairman and chief executive officer, Edwin H. Gott. The ship was originally built with two 16-cylinder Enterprise DMRV-16-4 diesel engines which powered twin propellers and was rated at 19,500 brake horsepower, 14,500 kilowatts, these were replaced with two 8-cylinder Mack Caterpillar 8M43C diesel engines which each produce 9,650 horsepower, 7,200 kilowatts, and are compliant with EPA emission requirements. The project was partly funded by a $750,000 EPA Clean Diesel Grant. MV Edwin H. Gott conducted sea trials of the new engines in March 2011. The ship was repowered at Bay Shipbuilding Company, Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin, during the winter of 2010-2011. When the ship was originally built, it was fitted with a shuttle boom that could extend 52 feet 16 meters, to either side of the stern of the vessel. This type of boom limited which ports the vessel could unload, as it required a dockside hopper. In the layup period between the 1995 and 1996 season, the vessel returned to Bay Shipbuilding Company, Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin, where it was fitted with a traditional unloading boom. The new boom, measuring 280 feet 85 meters, is the longest self-unloading boom used on any Great Lakes vessel. We hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.